It is day three. We're feeling a bit, a bit tired after two days full of diving, but we've decided to come up the coast. That's how I up to the leather bag. And uh, try and go even further to a new spot that I haven't dove either, and the boys definitely haven't. <laughs> We just got out here. It's a little bit windy and wild actually, but um, we're, we're coming up to the first spot now and I'm, boys are just getting ready. I'm gonna drop them on. Uh, we're just gonna suss out what this, this place looks like and kind of get our bearings. Get them, boys. Aww. 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 All right, get them, mate. Diving a new area. No Open for it. Okay, yeah, go that way. Keep you posted, mate. Josh just called me to pick him up. How is it, mate? Pretty dead. Oh, really? No luck. Oh, shit. Tell you what, that's one more thing that's worth it. Woo! Man, the fish are far and few between, but this reef is so nice. Like, proper plate coral and whatever else. We don't get this down outside of Australia, so. Man, it was cool to marvel at. Ooh, little, little parrotfish. Yeah, really? I feel like we are, yeah. conditions I've ever seen someone die. Harry and Josh are wild. I think we uh, killed the boys today. <laughs> Brandon's committed. I think he's actually asleep. Oh, he was. The next day was forecasted for a massive 30 knots, so we stayed out of the water, but not off the water. <laughs> Don't mind this line fishing thing. <laughs> hey, hey dog. little funny dog! What a dog! Alright, go it. Yeah, hold on. Last day of the trip, weather forecast, still not what you want, but we woke up and just thought, let's go out, just have a suss at least. Alright, back out here again today. Um, the other day was obviously shocking. Uh, a lot of rain and wind and no fish, but let's see how we go. This wild weather spear fishing. See if we can get it done. I have to stay very close together in the water. Feels like it's taking us a lot longer today. Hi! <laughs> Sunny day. <laughs> Back away. Go back to land. Go protect it. Now, if you had to just run. 
Yeah, if it gets too long. Well, I don't know. That's moving this way. That is moving very quick. Nice. Got it, man. I don't like this. It's like 50 years too. Technically, we're still a long way from home. Um, it's about not being in the market. It's a bit, a bit wild weather. We've got some good ideas. Josh and Brandon. Me and Joey are just going to stick together and we're getting both close to us and just trying to keep an eye on each other and that kind of thing. So we'll get in there and have a look. It's pretty blue. Yeah, it's bloody blue. Ooh. I think it's that way. Nice, hey? Oh, how good is that? Oh. Oh, what's it? <laughs> My turn to go down. Man, this area is so mountainous. I just spot a little tusky over that ridge, but it's playing cat and mouse. It's fishy. Big boy wants to get on. Fish tired. We drifted off that front part of the reef and off the side towards these beautiful big sandy plains that roll off that mountain of reef there. you're on to it out here you got to be counting heads and floats so we got three floats there one two three then we want to be counting three heads so you'll see one and two and the third one just popped up from a dive so we've got all the boys in how's this holy shit. got that radio on there just in case you get any weather updates of anything there's fish everywhere like sometimes this happens when it's crappy weather you just get fish everywhere there's, there's bait everywhere it, it's looking really good so uh, much better than the other day. We're in Queensland apparently, so Josh took his chance. Blue <laughs> Grover Dole. no take in New South Wales but in Queensland they aren't they're just uh, regulated I guess and there's plenty around these reefs and Josh decided to take one that nips to scratch after all these years they're known to be pretty good eating actually so it's about time to head further out but with the conditions looking the way they are we all kind of huddled together put in our five cents and made the decision that we didn't want to have to make on the last day of our trip but I think we'll all feel a bit more comfortable once we're in some protection and hopefully we can still find a few little spots of fish. Alright, we're in here. It's a lot nicer now. I am hot. My rain's away. It is cold. It is cold. It is very, very cold.
We moved spots and before we could get to the bottom, Brandon had already plugged the first. My turn to have a snoop down the bottom at the last spot. So dark. What a big day is diving. I don't know if you can hear me, but it was a big day diving. We really put in the miles to kind of get some fish, get some good dives in, but also make a video. So if you do like the videos, then do subscribe and turn the notifications on if you want to see it straight away. Regardless, I'll see you when I'm out there next. G'day, thanks for taking us out, brother. It's a bit wild out here.